So today, I'm gonna be talking about the pressure of purposeful peace. In John 14 and 27, Jesus is basically talking to his disciples in which who he calls his friends, letting them know, hey, I'm about to get up on out of here, I'm about to head to heaven, I'm leaving this earth, but I want y'all to know that I'm leaving peace with y'all. The peace I give to you, the peace I leave with you is not the same peace of this world. So peace is basically freedom of disturbance. So truthfully, what a lot of us may call peace is really silent chaos. A lot of times we may feel we're the people that we're around, the environments that we're in, or even sometimes being alone, we misconstrue these things as being um, our safety net, our peace. And a lot for a lot of us, that is true. And don't get me wrong, it's cool. It's I love being alone sometimes. I like to be around. I love to be around people more. But a lot of times, it's not good for us to be alone. And that can form silent chaos in your mind. You miss you you misinterpret that moment, and you really should be around people. You really need. Uh, the peace of God and a lot of times the peace of God is in other people and so what we do is we get by ourselves and all this silent chaos is going on in our minds we start thinking about all kind of crazy stuff off the wall when really we should have been in put we should have put ourselves in the position to be around other people so I want to encourage you today find purposeful peace exit out that fake peace peace should be can be found within that moment and after that moment is over, that's real, true peace. And this is just for cer certain situations, but if you're getting peace just in that moment, it's probably not real peace. It's probably not the peace of God. It's probably fake peace. Put pressure on finding that real peace. Don't take the peace of the world. It's not the same. The peace of the world won't sustain you as long as God's peace will. Even when you don't feel like you have a peace, God's peace is gonna always surround you. He give you pieces that surpasses all understanding even when you don't understand what's going on. You don't understand how long the peace is going to last. That peace is going to always be here with you.